I could sleep all day long in this bed, but I'm way too hungry. All right, I'm allowed to go out now. Sean! Finally. Sean, are you awake? Breakfast's almost done, so come down when you're ready, okay? Okay! Careful! Tunnels ahead! Hold your breath! Whoa! We made it! I get why Dad never brought us down here. Oh my, look who's awake. Good morning, sleepyhead. It's that bed. Feels like a cloud. <laughs> I know. Daniel, <sighs> breakfast time. Your brother is ready. <sighs> Grandpa's showing me a pop star. Steven, your grandson needs to eat now. You can show him the boxcar later. I love how they're getting along. Do you need help or anything? Oh, don't worry. I can do this in the dark. <laughs> but thanks for the offer. <laughs> All right, all right. Are you boys done playing? We had a express delivery with the passengers. But the engine broke down. Yep. Straight to the workshop. Good. No trains in the kitchen, remember? Gotcha, Chief. Choo-choo! <laughs> Ah, oh, sugar. <sighs> he can fix his trains, but not my kitchen. Did I make enough? Everything's okay? It's great, as usual. You're the best cook ever. Looks like you're getting cozy with this new country life after all. I miss Seattle, my friends. Oh, there's so much more to do in the city. <laughs> there's more crime, more traffic. Nobody can go out anymore. I think there's crime everywhere. I love Seattle, but it's cool here too. Well, it's certainly safer for children. Everybody out here is a neighbor. We try to lend a hand, like to Charles next door. He lost his wife, and things have been hard on him and his son. He would just get lost in Seattle. But we're all taking care of him here. How old is his son? I, I think he's your age. Ooh, cool.
<laughs> I thought Stephen was a fast eater. Hey, Grandma. I wanted to ask you something. About that locked room upstairs. I told you, there is nothing to see in it, Daniel. Why were you in it this morning, then? Because there's a lot of old junk in there. And besides, it's not safe for you to explore, okay? <sighs> this is bullshit. Daniel, language. Why don't you go explore outside? You sure look like you're getting better. Get some fresh air. I'll wait for Sean, and then we'll go. We won't be loud. Promise. But be careful nobody sees you. Stay in the back, okay? Maybe you should tell him that it was Karen's room. And maybe you should tell him to watch his mouth. It's just a room now, Sean. Nothing to see. <laughs> 